Hey guys, what's up? I'm Roger Workman and this is Q. Together we're Mr. Happy 0121. Today, McDonald's secret menu. We are going to enjoy the world famous, except at our McDonald's, Mick Gangbang. This is a secret uh, menu item. The thing about the secret menu item, I've, I've watched a few videos of people trying these. They all buy the, se the ingredients separate and then put put it together themselves. That's not really a secret menu, that's do it yourself. We tried to actually purchase this as is. We have two McDonald's in our town, and this is an absolutely true story. The first McDonald's we went to, I asked for a McGangbang, and the lady told me I was not the least bit funny and asked us to leave. So, we did. We went across town, which in our town is like a mile and a half to the other McDonald's. Where surprisingly enough, upon asking for a McGangbang, the girl laughed and said, yes, we can do that. We've only done it three times, and we hope we do it right, but we'll make you one. So, here's what we got. Uh, they wrapped it in a McDouble wrapper. And for those of you that don't know and think that I've lost my mind, what this sandwich is, is it's a McDouble with a McChicken inserted right in between the patties in the middle. Yum, I guess. So, if in fact, you go by the law of secret menu, this really is something that they will make. You do not have to do it yourself. I think we would have been better served making the video of us asking for a McGangbang than actually eating it, because that was pretty entertaining. As far as I know, they don't leave anything off. It's everything that comes on both, just with a sandwich stuck in the middle. Okay, we're going to try this thing. Wish us luck. You go first, Q. All right. And the rating system is in place. Wow. That's messy, for one thing. That was a little bite, dude. You got man up. I give it a B, a Hank, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, strong B. Red letter day, dude. We're in agreement. Let me try one more, I think. I think that's a definite B. That's not near as gross as I thought it would be. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's good. I don't know what I imagined it would be, but I guess that's exactly what I thought it would be. A chicken sandwich inside of a hamburger. Uh, the mayonnaise doesn't clash too bad. The pickle tastes good. Spicy, a little bit. A little bit spicy. It's like, kind of like a spicy McDouble. Yeah, that's what I've got. That was an easy one. That was way easier than I thought. It's a solid B. So if you really feel the need to get a lot of food for cheap, that's the way to go. They actually didn't know how to ring this up. They charged us like $2.40 for the sandwich, which is cheaper than if you buy each individually, even though both are in there. So that's one thing. Okay, question of the day. You're on a sinking ship, All right. and you have Jaden Smith and Willow Smith. You need to lose about 100 pounds, or you and five other people are going to die. You have to throw one of them over the ledge to their death. Who would it be? Jane Smith. I agree with you. I agree with you. Jane Smith. You're the karate kid. Swim your ass to shore. Kung fu. You little punk. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Good episode. We, we are in total agreement. This will never happen. This is a red letter day. All right. Thanks for watching.